Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about a new screen recording tool from Hitpaw, which also has live streaming features, editing features, snipping, and more. In this video, we're going to showcase all the features and all the functions of the software and see how we can use it. Of course, you can check out Hitpaw Screen Recorder from their official website in the description below. You can see a quick description of the software. You can capture and record desktop, gameplay, webcam, and more, and also live stream. In this video, as I've said, I'm going to show you how you can use the software. When you open it up for the first time, we're going to notice this interface and you have two sections record and live in the record section you have screen game lecture device and you also have templates in the live streaming section you're going to be able to use the software to live stream i'm just going to go quickly onto the live streaming section because in this video we're going to focus on the recording section but let's go to live streaming just to showcase how the live streaming section looks and basically as you can see you have options for microphone speakers you can add sources basically you can add screen game window webcam and what you want and select everything and basically you can use it like other live streaming software at your webcam it's really really simple and you can use a template backgrounds texts and you can also add stickers i think that is pretty interesting and of course whenever you want to live stream you're going to be able to select the platform that you want to live stream on you can select zoom youtube live for example twitch and more now let's go to the recording section i'm just going to go to screen select this and then we're going to have to select the area of the screen that we want to record and the ui is very intuitive basically you have the record button you have the screenshot picture in picture draw capture mouse, capture keystrokes, disable speaker, disable microphone, enable camera, task, and settings. Basically, whenever you want to record for the first time with the software, you're going to have to go into the settings section and select the recording options. For example, I want to record 60 frames per second. I'm just going to leave the resolution as original. Output format, I'm going to leave it on MP4. And the output location, let's change it to the desktop. You also have audio settings. For example, you can change the microphone and also the speakers. As easy as that. Add effects to your mouse. For example, an effect like this and you can also show keystrokes in the task section you can schedule a recording select a segment recording and set it to automatically stop whenever you want it you have the hotkeys f10 to start and stop f9 to pause and resume f8 to hide menu and more basically the classic keyboard hotkeys for a recording software after we've done our settings let's go ahead and start recording i'm just gonna start recording here in this section as i've said now i'm just gonna go into the display section and here i'm just gonna show something on the screen let's also take a screenshot that will be automatically saved in the software and we can also do picture in picture if we want to also record our webcam we can draw as easy as that as you can see you can select the type of drawing tool select the color and the size you can draw on the screen you can delete everything it's really simple you can do arrows highlight text and more i think this is pretty useful also it will capture our keystrokes so for example let's search something into settings for example windows and then we're going to notice at the end after we stop the recording what will happen now let's stop the recording and you're going to notice that the recording will be automatically opened in their official player which you can use to quickly edit your video or select tracks and more let's click on edit and you're going to notice here you have a really simplistic editor that will help you cut the rough edges in a video for example i want it to be something like this i'm just gonna apply these things around so that we can showcase the editing process or you can crop things if you don't want it to be full screen you can crop it like this using your mouse to change the ratio or change the scaling using this if you want but if you leave it on custom you're gonna be able to drag it wherever you want you can also resize you have the original resolution and you can resize it and you can add a background color Color if the size is smaller speed adjust the brightness saturation contrast and more and you can also rotate it if you want more features you're going to be able to get another software from hitpop which provides you with more features but i think these features that you find in this small editor are more than enough to quickly cut the rough edges and simply edit a, a video tutorial for example a gameplay or anything like that after we've edited it we're going to have to export it and i'm going to click on export and it will be quickly exported as you can see it has around 12 megabytes and as we set it of course the output was selected Selected on desktop the highlights and more as you can see it is recorded on 60 frames per second we also have the keystrokes i think that is great in the main interface of the software you're going to be able to track down the history of your recordings or live streams basically we can also see here our screen capture that we've done inside the recording as you saw earlier and i think that is great also let me showcase the gaming recording process again you're going to have to select a game window or capture any full screen application and all the settings are pretty much the same so i think this is pretty easy to use 
use. I think this is a great software from Hitbox that you can use to either record your desktop, your gameplay, maybe do a presentation or even live stream on the most popular platforms. Don't forget to check out Hitbox Screen Recorder from the description below and try it out for free and see if it's a good software for you or not. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Zimani from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.